one for yourself, just a few minutes long. I'm sure he, he, you know, he's awesome at doing that sort of thing, as we saw last week. <clears throat> okay, so uh, in here, uh, you'll have a dashboard. Mine's got a lot of extra stuff in here because I'm a board member. There's more, there's more stuff in here that, that you guys don't have. But up here is really what, what you want to be focusing on up, up here. So uh, if we go into tips, I want to show you what's available in here. So these are the tips for the past 12 months. You can see the ones that I've sent, the ones that I've received, you know, any value and the tips that I've received. Uh, I can go pop in here. I can send a tip if I want to. I can search here for, I need to send one to Mikey for my donation this month. Oh, it doesn't say Mikey. Oh, I'm searching by category up there. I'm sorry, search by name is over here. If I could spell, it would work. Here, yeah, send a tip. And it's from here inside. It's all this information is already filled out, so I don't even have to do that. I just go um, donation this month. Uh, I can specify the tip value if I know how much it's going to be, uh, or I can let her do it later on. I'm going to show you how to do that. Submit the tip, and then tip submitted, and then it will show up in my sent tips, uh, basically instantaneously. There's the one for Mikey just here. Okay, so uh, you can also look at my received tips. Now, this is something that Anastasia really wanted you guys to to know about and to learn about and to uh, work with um, because it's something that's very important for um, tracking our dollar our dollars income. So uh, you can see in here I can edit a tip. Okay, so uh, I can pop in here. I can edit the tip. I can change the I can change the uh, amount or sorry the uh, status of the tip in through here. I can make it bogus or invalid. I can say it's closed. I can say it's working. This one we're, we're working. And to date, um, thank you very much, BJ. You've uh, given us $510 worth of uh, our services. I very much appreciate that. Uh, and uh, you can just go ahead and put the amount in there. So that's really the most important place to put in the, the dollars uh, that you've received from tips. Um, does anybody have any questions about that? I really want to make sure that people people get that part of that. Um, are they going to be, should everybody be logging on to this at the same time? Uh, yes. You want everybody to go get logged into uh, letipwired.com at the same time so you can kind of see it for yourself. And if anybody has any questions about that, let me know. And I did have a question. What do you mean by it's going to be like um, Angie's list? Like, how do you know how that's going to work? Is it going to be published out on, like, on the internet as far as searchability for something? If you want to find a videographer or a locksmith? Yes, exactly. Yes, that is the plan. But they definitely can't do it right now because most a lot of people don't have their bios uh, filled in okay. fully. So um, it's it's something that that we're working they're working towards to um, to get this uh, filled out. <clears throat> okay. Uh, if you. Uh, Typing and unmuted, I can hear you. Sorry, right. <laughs> sorry, that's me. Uh, that's okay. <laughs> uh, so then, I also want to pop into settings and notifications because this is also an area where you want to uh, make sure that you've got things set up how you want them. Okay, so in here is how you get all the notifications for anything that's been sent. So uh, there's notifications for tips. And you can choose to get them via text or via email. Uh, and corporate notifications, chapter notifications, billing, all, all the different types of notifications uh, 
are, are in are in here. So you can choose how you get how you get them, and uh, whether it's text or email. You do need to make sure that your phone number is correct up in here. You do need to make sure that your email is correct up in here, and those are set in the uh, in the profile to start with. You can add phone numbers in here as well. So if if for instance, I wanted to add the phone number for uh, one of my employees, I could add a phone phone number in there so that they could receive texts about tips or anything like that coming in as well, uh, or emails obviously as well. Okay. Then the other thing I really wanted to, to let people know about is this new, it's a new thing, it's called My Extended Network. So you can see in here, I've got my employees in here and uh, my husband in here. <clears throat> what I've done is I've invited an extended network member. I just click this and I'm going to, if I can get out of this full screen, yeah, uh, just pop into here for a second because I've done, we did some, I did some work with Steve. <clears throat> My extended network. Yeah, my extended network. I need an extended exactly. network. And just bigger here. So just let me go from Remember. here. Uh, so who can anybody like, like brothers, sisters, friends? You can you can send this to anybody, right? And this is some, this is one that Steve did to me. So he invited me to his extended network. Huh. Okay. You can. I recommend that when you invite a guest, that you send them you send them a link for my extended network because what that does is it gives them a link to everybody in our group and then they can do they can send tips that are uh, they can send tips to members in our group and they get counted towards your your uh tip count catherine this is jason can, can i ask you a quick question of course go um, ahead jason simply because this, this whole thing is foreign to me and i definitely don't want to hold everyone back but I have no idea how to get to where you are. Is that something that I oh, should be able to access? Or Jason, not? I'm sorry. No, you can't because you need to be okay. able to access okay. this. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Great. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that. No, 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 no. Good question. Do we yeah. show up in publicly? Does it show up at all as uh, for what is the tip wired for somebody who's not a member? Is it? Yeah. So I'm gonna I'm gonna walk walk you through that. Okay. So so what happens is come on page down. There we go. Okay, so this is the email that gets sent out to to somebody when you send send an invitation. So hello, the person that you sent it to, I'm inviting you. To blah, 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 blah. Uh, please access your personalized dashboard using the link below. You click on that link, and then it sends you a uh, a, a video. This is the link of that it sends to. I can going to send out this link. To you guys all so that you know exactly where it's going to you can go and watch the youtube video so that you know what people are getting when they when they see uh the video i'm not going to play it now it's a couple of minutes long but it's also i just need to let you guys know right now um it explains it very much from somebody who knows what the tip is so if you like when i sent it to my husband for instance I mean, he knew what they were talking about because I've been in the tip for such a long time, but I've given them some feedback already about this because it's it's for somebody who's never experienced the tip, they're going to not quite understand what they need to do. Okay. So that's something they need to work on, but you just you be aware that that is how it is right now. Oops. Okay, so this is when they when they click on it, they get they, they watch the video and then this shows up for them. Uh, this is like an app that, that they put on their phone or they have available on their uh, I guess on their desktop too and so what it's showing us what it shows you is are all of the categories and it says to you know you just tip now so you just click on tip now and then uh what shows up is so here i clicked on steve masses to tip now so it shows you a little bit more about who the person works for uh, and the description for it so this information, including the profile pictures and everything like that, comes from your profile. 
So you want to make sure that you have your profile filled out so that this information is filled out. And then I go ahead and uh, if I click on send a tip now, it goes send a tip and then I fill in the information just like I would on a regular tip form uh, and press submit. And then the tip goes to uh, tip goes to the person. So this is in Steve's, this is in Steve's uh, tips, receive tips. And it shows up, there's a little icon that's here that is uh, like, a, like a world type of thing. And if you hover over it, then it shows you that it was the extended network and that I sent him the tip from his extended network. Does that make sense to you guys? Yeah, that's kind of neat. Yeah, it's super cool. And then this tip gets counted for Steve as part of his tip count. So any guests or family members or anything like anybody, your know, employees or anybody who uses the extended network app will uh, well, if they send tips, it's going to count for your tip, your tip count. Okay. Get rid of that. Go back to here. Okay, so that's my extended network. Does anybody have any other questions about about my extended network? I think we'll have to, what's a good way for everybody to go do that? Who should they send it to first? Their friend? Their I would send it wife. to somebody who you're close to. Um, you know, like send it to your wife or send it to somebody who you can interact with really easily so that you can you can play with it with them. Yeah, uh, it's, it's built for your employees and colleagues. It is, and, and I would definitely, you know, send it to somebody that who you can walk through with them very very easily so you understand how it works and, and and what it looks like when they see it so that when you when you do send it to anybody else that you can you can explain to them and help help them walk, walk them through it hey doug you can you explain that what do you mean by it's built for your employees and say what was the other thing you said your employees colleagues. and colleagues so you show up right for for mike uh goldstein right as his colleagues the other attorneys in his office right uh you have employees that are going out you guys have to bring in outside tips, right? And all of your employees or colleagues are constantly saying, oh, you know, today you have a, a guest, right? Oh, you have some toner needs? Here's my toner guy. Oh, you 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 want to refinance your mortgage because it's the lowest rates they've ever been? Here's my guy, Steve Mass, right? And all your employees or colleagues know that you're a part of LATIP, so they'll understand that you're passing referrals. So if you make that available to them, they will see your extended network, which is everybody in your chapter or anybody from any other chapter that you add in. Okay, and then you would tell them like, "Hey, if you're if you ever need a, you hear somebody who has a, a needs a loan, go on to the tip wire, go find Steve Mass, send him a tip, and then it counts. Would it count like, for instance, if it was my friend, my in my extended, would it count? It go it goes through your account. It will show up on the tip report as you gave and they received, and you'll get a notice inside your wired account that uh, your employee sent these referrals, so you get credit for it. Yes, you'll see them, so you're aware of them, and it goes to the tip report under your account. Excellent. That's pretty slick. It is pretty sweet. <laughs> cool. All right. Uh, so then the other uh, thing that I wanted to point out on here is the messages feature. And uh, the messages is it's kind of like a texting uh, option in here. You can send you can send uh, messages to individual people. You can send messages to the whole to the whole group. So I uh, just pop in here. I can send it to the entire network. Send it to all members of the tip of Westside Referral Network, or I can choose somebody to send it to in here. Uh, and it's just like, um, hey, good to see you. And send message. And then it pops up in here, it's saying, so the Q, Q has got a message from me, uh, and then he'll get, he'll get a notification. If he set up his notifications and his settings and notifications, that uh, to, as to where to receive the message notifications. So again, if you go back into here, you need to make sure that your message notifications have some way of the messages getting to you. 
doesn't matter which one you choose, you get to choose that, but uh, that gives you how they're going to arrive for you. Uh, the, we do not have the ability to attach anything to these messages at this point in time. Uh, so you can't send a, you know, you can't send a, a PDF document or anything like that within this messaging system. It's something that I've asked for, and uh, hopefully they'll be able to add this in at some at some stage. Doctor Macy, so, mm -hmm. go ahead, Payam. Uh, if uh we would be putting a link for a PDF or a document that is an active link from a Google Drive. Would that be workable with people access it through this or not? Yeah, that should totally work. Absolutely. Okay. Good, yeah. good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very good point. Right. Any other questions about this? Nope. Nope. Okay, great. All right. Um, this is awesome. Yeah, it is awesome. <laughs> I was very excited about all of this when we, when we got to see it. So, all when I noodled around on it. Uh, and the only other, the other things that's, that, I mean, just take some time and click on everything that's in here. I don't think you'll break anything. It's been, it's been pretty well tested at this point in time. So, I don't yeah, think I you'll break some, anything. See who's uh, gotten logged in this morning? Is everybody logged in right now? Can I get hands up of everybody who's got logged in? Okay, cool. Okay, so quite a few of you, that's great. Yeah, that's great. Good, 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 good. All right, so do take some time. Uh, the, the functionality on the, uh, on the desktop is, is obviously much greater than what's available on your phone. You know, it's, uh, there's a lot, of, a lot more details that you can get into and, and that sort of thing. But, you know, it's, it's, a great, it's a great way to keep track of your tips going out, coming in. Mm -hmm. Janet, I can't log in. I I don't know what my uh, username and password is. Who should I talk to? So uh, I sent an email last week with um, oh, Doug, help me out. The gal's name Ruiz. What's her first name? Carolina. Carolina. Thank you. Carolina Ruiz's uh, phone, num phone phone number, so she can help you out. You can just give her a call, and she will okay. help you out directly. Okay. Actually, um, Dr. Afo, you're not the only one because someone else uh, chatted with me. It's very simple. Uh, it's your first initial, J, and your last name, Rafoa, J. Rafoa. So everybody's pass, everybody's login is going to be the same, right? D. Christian for Doug Christian. Your password we won't know, but right underneath the secure member sign in, it says, I forgot my password. It's going to shoot you an email. You can reset it right now while you're online. It's all okay. automated, right? I would recommend what Catherine just shared. I mean, she just gave you a, a 30,000 foot view, an overview of what some of what the capability is here, but you can also email Carolina. And once again, just like you guys, her email, Carolina C for Carolina, Ruiz, C R U I Z at latip.com. Uh, Carolina will spend 30 minutes with you of her time teaching you about the extended network teaching you about all the valuable tools that are inside Wired, whether it be the extended network or the document library or the web store or how to sign up for the NTS if you haven't taken that and you're new. Uh, Carolina Ruiz will help you and spend time with you teaching you about Wired. It's part of your membership. It's just additional value that we'd like to provide. Uh, your president, um, Catherine, um, Madam President, has stepped up just to make sure that you guys are using tools that help benefit both your group and your personal membership. Sorry, Catherine. No, 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 that's great. Thank you so much for the addition, Doug. And I'm glad that you had uh, Carolina's information at hand so readily. I appreciate it. Okay, uh, so I, uh, does anybody have any other questions about- if Anybody, yeah, I was gonna say, if or... anybody can't get logged in, um, let's get everybody logged in. I, we've heard the, um, hey, I don't know my password, I don't know my user, for a long time so you know by next week i want everybody to be logged in and if you're having a problem you know first thing is go set reset my password um and then if you're still having a problem you can you can call anastasia catherine or myself 